Michigan is expected to be well represented in the college football playoff. A large contingency of fans are expected to make their way out to Arizona. Would you expect anything less? As we saw in Indianapolis for the conference championship, Michigan fans are everywhere. Luke Laster has more. Welcome to the Maze Bus. Let's go Blue! Where the Wolverines go, the bus goes too. I've gone to baseball, softball, football, everything, volleyball, anything that's in the Midwest, the bus is at. That was Roger Hale, the Omaha, Nebraska native and owner of this photo-filled four-wheel minibus. For the Big Ten championship game, you'll find it parked in front of the Wolverine-infiltrated O'Reilly's Irish Pub. Did I mention this is an Indianapolis bar and not Ann Arbor? Now, in its second year, back-to-back -back trips to O'Reilly's quickly cements this bar in maize and blue. Shinji Takahashi, president of the Indianapolis Alumni Club of Michigan, says O'Reilly's becoming a Michigan bar spans over a decade ago, long before he took over as president. Once he did, he said the backing to make it a Wolverines bar started gaining more traction, bringing us to where we are today. And over time, it just kind of by word of mouth and promotion on the uh, website at Ann Arbor Alumni Association just became the place for Michigan football in Indianapolis. Let's go Blue! Let's go Blue! Chance and camaraderie flood this bar. Let's go well, that's how we grow as a family. We just you meet the people, we travel hard, and that's who we are. And traveling hard is what this fan base and the Maze Bus do to keep that Wolverine spirit heard around the country. Let's go Blue, baby. From Omaha to Indianapolis and all the way back to Ann Arbor, the Maze Bus knows no boundaries. But one thing I can say for certain is that these fans are hoping to take it straight to Inglewood, California. Reporting in Indianapolis, I'm Luke Laster.